Segas Konagoa, Kwe, Watcha, Ai, Hello, Bonjour. My name is Dr. Saylor. I'm the director of the Indigenous Health Curriculum here at McGill. I'm originally from Ganawage Reserve, Mohawk Territory, and I've been a physician for just about 20 years now. There's many health discrepancies faced by Indigenous people, not just in Quebec, but across Canada. And McGill has finally realized that uh, something needs to be done about this. Medical students, nurses, anyone working in the healthcare field really has to learn a lot more about Indigenous people's health. McGill Medicine has a new curriculum, which is very, very exciting. There is an Indigenous theme all throughout the four years of medicine. In the first year, it actually started on the first day. The whole system, how things are set up, are really set up for a failure for many First Nations. Respiratory health, mental health, Indigenous peoples, the social determinants of health. And we try to tie it together with why being a culturally safe physician is very important. We have people who come to tell us their experience. It's really touching. It's going to touch everyone in our class. I went to Indian day school. I got my ass kicked left and right. I lost my language because of that place. At that time when we all went in, I happened to be almost the youngest. I was five. We're here to try our best to share our lived experience. What's great about it is it's not just for the Indigenous students. We teach all the students about some of the health disparities and uh, problems, uh, health-related problems for Indigenous peoples. Hi, how are you? In my first year of medicine, we were exposed to the clinic very early on. Uh, we are matched with preceptors and we get to follow them in the clinic and in the hospital. So I'll be looking at your, your abdomen and I'll be visualizing your aorta. It's a great experience to learn how to interact with patients and to learn just about the medical field in general. You have the opportunity as well to do your rotation in an Indigenous community. One of the reasons why I chose McGill is because of the unique opportunity to be able to um, go to an Indigenous community, practice there. That's the whole point of coming to school, right? Was to go home and serve our people and work with our people. The First People's House is a part of student services. We're here to uh, support Indigenous students on campus. First People's House here at McGill, it's a home away from home. It's like a little community. Everybody's there to help each other. Academic support, social activities, cultural activities, we have our residents. Just seeing more representation of Aboriginal culture in a, on campus has been phenomenal. It just picks up your spirit and it helps you keep going. And there's always somebody to talk here. So my name is Kate Hooten and I'm the Director of Admissions for the Faculty of Medicine. The four faculties of medicine in Quebec uh, share four reserved spots for First Nations and Inuit uh, applicants from the province of Quebec. The application process sometimes can seem a little daunting or people sometimes don't feel like they, they want to ask questions, but we really encourage you to get in touch with the admissions office. Um, we're really there for you. I have one simple message for future Indigenous physicians. We want you here at McGill. Just apply. There are spots reserved for us. There are tons of resources on campus. On est entendu. Si on a quelque chose, si on peut parler à Dr. Saylor, puis il va nous accommoder. Il va, il va nous aider. Wesley Cote. I'm feeling uh, overwhelmed with joy. I'm happy. It's uh, bittersweet. It shows that it signifies a lot of hard work has paid off. You are the future of our health for our people.